a Roadrunner. He's got I something. Oh, he's got a grasshopper. Here we are. Right at Lake Meredith, Texas. Nice little campground out here. Very nice campground. Free parking over here on the lake. They got a sewer dump and water. You can come up here if you need power. Pay a few dollars for power. I think it's 10 bucks. Maybe 15. But finally the wind went down today. We came in here yesterday. The lake is just beautiful. This is a big lake. Big reservoir, actually. Got fire pits out here. Nice little cabanas. We're over here with the Childers. Nomadic Ramblers. That's their rig right up here. We're going to travel with them the next couple days. Probably the next week. Going to head on down to Lola Palooza. Have a good time with some fellow YouTubers and some other subscribers. But you never know what you're going to see out here. Look at him. They got a pretty good drop off right here, so you really can't walk down to the water. But this guy here is just happy. He's looking for food. He's not scared at all. So how many of you have seen a Roadrunner before? We are north of Amarillo. Big dam up there. Plenty of camping out here, y'all. And this is free. We went today and went through this whole area down here and picked up two bags of uh, dog crap. And uh, wasn't ours, but we thought we'd do our due diligence to help keep places like this free and keep it clean. It's not too trashy. A little bit here and there, but it's probably because of the wind. But man, this is fantastic. Couple boats out today. Finally, the sun broke. Getting plenty of solar. Sitting over here, enjoying the outdoors. Once again, in the back parking lot, parked next to the I guess we could call them the bringing in the steak trucks. We're right back at the big Texan Steakhouse and Brewery. We were here about three years ago, four, four, years, ago. four years ago, had a great meal. This is one of our favorite places to stop. <laughs> It's a little bit windy out here in Amarillo today. Another cold front coming through. 
So uh, we're gonna go get a little lunch on our way south towards uh, Abilene, I guess. So this is the entrance to the steakhouse. When you come in, you go to the right to go eat. And they got a little gift shop over here to the left. Some great little treats up in here. And according to Texas State law now, you have to wear masks and do social distancing. So we're gonna follow along with the rules and get us something to eat. This is what we gotta do in 2020. That's right, huh? Such a great year. <laughs> yeah. And I don't even know if you can hear me. But we're just waiting for uh, the childers to go back and get their masks. So well, we can sure. so we can comply. Hey, you wanna get that over your nose, lady? I can't breathe. Don't be, don't be violated. Alright, here we are gonna uh, sit down and do a little dining. Yeah. We got ribeyes, we've got uh, prime rib, we got baked potatoes, <laughs> mac and cheese, fries, okra. and some okra. Looking good there, girl. Yeah, All yeah, right. Good. Mm -hmm. Every once in a while you got to splurge and that's what we're doing. Yep. Today we are camping at a city park in Knox City, Texas, right off Highway 6. We're on our way down to Dallas. We thought we'd stop here for a couple nights. They offer free electricity, sewer, and and water. Yep. <clears throat> and you can't beat that for free. After that, it's uh, ten dollars a night, and you can stay here 14 days if you want to pay ten dollars a night. But they've got a nice park across the way if you've got kids or need to get, get out and exercise the dog. They take care of it really well. Um, <clears throat> we really appreciate Knox City. Uh, hospitality here. They've got an IGA grocery store here. Reasonable prices. So, uh, what do you think of it, Kim? I like it. I wouldn't want to live here, but <laughs> it's kind of, it's a small, small, small town. Yeah. But it's a, it's a nice, quaint little town. Yep, it's a good stop. Again, we're looking for places we can boondock for free. And we are going to pursue some more uh, uh, city parks, I think. Yeah. There's a I mean, bunch of them in Texas. So we'll find them. But anyway, we're going to get on the road. We're going to follow down with some fellow RVers and fellow YouTubers. You'll see them later. The wind's starting to blow again today. It's going to be blowing 10 to 15 from the south. And there's a good cold front coming down. Good. But we're going to get everything wrapped up and get ready to make good our travel. travels down south to Lollapalooza. See you there. Stop the madness. Start the adventure.